All right, guys, uh, what we have right here is a Mini Cooper, um, and we're going to demonstrate the iCarsoft CR Plus here. Um, you may notice there are a few dashboard warning lights on with the red one. is just the brake light, the handbrake. Uh, then we've got the orange ABS and the orange uh, tyre pressure. Uh, this is, is because of an ABS fault. Generally, if you get a problem like this or a set of uh, lights like this, it's relating to an ABS sensor. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to demonstrate the iCars of the CR Plus, which is available. Just by clicking the link below this video, or you can visit www.ukprodiagnostics.co.uk. Uh, but we're going to show you how to diagnose this. So we're searching for our vehicle, which is a Mini. And we're going to go to ABS, ESC, DSC. And it's going to give us the option to read fault codes. So we've got read fault memory. That's telling us 5DC0, wheel speed sensor, rear right. So that's the rear right as you're actually sitting in the vehicle. Um, now, changing an ABS sensor is certainly a DIY job, we would say. Um, in this particular vehicle, in fact, we have got a, a DIY video guide on how to actually change and uh, reset the ABS sensor uh, and change over the ABS sensor in your in the rear of the vehicle. There's one ABS sensor on each wheel, so you've got four in total. Um, but this is the iCarsoft CR Plus, just simply diagnosing the ABS fault. Uh, once the new ABS sensor is installed, then it will be a case of coming out, going into clear fault memory, and then when the wheels start moving, all of your lights would disappear from the dashboard. Alright, so thanks for watching, and I hope this helps.